Welcome, everyone, to another episode of Dino Times. I'm your host, Dakota Morgan, coming to you from Phoenix, Arizona. And today we're going to be doing a species profile, but kind of a quick one today, because we're going to be talking about Titanosaurus. Why, though? Well, I figured with Jurassic World Rebirth around the corner, and we have the Titanosaurus, of course, making a huge appearance, I figured let's cover some facts about this dinosaur, or more specifically, dinosaur genus. Titanosaurus, of course, as you can tell, as you're intelligent human beings, all of you, because you, you're watching Dino Times, but that is Titanic Lizard. The type species is Titanosaurus indicus, it was named in 1877, and T. Blanford E. Blanford I, I should say, was named in 1879 in the Lammoth Formation by Richard Edgar. Now, jogglingly though, Titanosaurus is one of those who actually do fall into the dubious genus of sauropod dinosaurs, meaning it's just, it's it covers a lot. <laughs> it covers a lot of different sauropods. Now, we only don't have that many remains, but what happens is almost as known waste box, waste box taxon. Uh, and sauropods, they just get known as titanosaurs, or they just get the name titanosaurs. And it's very odd, but it's a thing in paleontology where that does happen. We do have some known remains, though, in a way, and the bones that we did find were a 4.9 foot long femur. And these known remains of Titanosaurus indicus were actually considered lost at the end of the 20th century. But in 2010, there was actually cast made of these uh, fossils. And how were they made? Well, they were made by Matthew and were based on illustrations done of the fossils before they were lost. So needless to say, though, Titanosaurus is very complicated. It's known as a wasteback syntax and, and more of a it's a genus of dinosaurs, of long-necked sauropods. But there is a couple that are exclusively Titanosaurus. Does that mean we'll have a very exclusive Titanosaurus fossils found in the future? One may hope so, but in the meantime, when you see Jurassic World Rebirth, you can be like, hey, something off about that in the true history of Titanosaurus is, and it's just a genus of dinosaurs with a couple in there and with a couple species, subspecies that we don't have fossils for currently. But never say never when it comes to paleontology, everybody. Now, if you did enjoy this quick little facts about Titanosaurus, well, not much to go on for them, but hey, you at least learned a little bit here. You should have subscribed to Dino Times for more news, BC's profiles, and much, much more on the channel. I've been host Dakota Morgan. Follow me on social media down below in the description box, Twitch and all. And remember, everybody, science is real. <laughs>